Calf rearers from across the southwest gathered at Cats Hill Farm in Wiltshire for the first in a series of Rethinking Cattle Performance Workshops. Hosted and organised by Farmers Weekly and supported by our sponsors ABP, Zoetis and Volac, the workshops aim to help farmers improve their calf rearing operations. The lessons and advice are all about simple and clear measures that, when combined, will make a big difference to productivity and profitability. The day at Cats Hill Farm focused on three central themes – housing, health and nutrition. Jamie Robertson, Honorary Research Fellow at Aberdeen University, was on hand to talk us through the most important environmental considerations when rearing calves. I sort of work a, a four-pointer system, whether it's young stock or old stock, the, the main things are moisture. Do you have the moisture under control? Um, far too many buildings, uh, moisture is out of control. There is too much moisture in the building, and that just relates directly to pathogen growth, poor hygiene, low temperatures. So moisture is the first one, uh, fresh air is the second one. We need to understand the value of fresh air. It's very good at removing stuff, but it's also very important for making things grow. So that's quite simple too. And the problem is we live in a wet and windy climate. So they kind of go, well, we don't want the windy bit, which is the third point, airspeed. Excessive airspeed is actually the most demanding of the environmental factors on mammals, we're warm-blooded, um, and young calves that we're talking about today um, you know, they're actually extremely susceptible to air speed, a draft. Yeah? So the end come back, well you want fresh air but you don't want a draft, so we get this conflict in terms of design. Yeah? And then the fourth thing is actually temperature. Whilst cows might not be temperature sensitive, um, a dairy calf is. And if you want on a cold day like today, temperature is a little bit of an issue, but then you stick it in a draft in a high moist environment and it all goes to hell in a handcart. 